November is Native American Heritage Month. It brings us to Project Angel Food because of their Native American Diabetes Project. What's that about? Well, we're learning that this is what we should be eating, fruits, vegetables, lots of colors. But this is what a lot of us, including Native Americans, are actually eating. Processed food, not good. In case you don't know, that is spam. Yes, that's how it looks like out of the can. Project Angel Food, Native American Diabetes Project, is producing these medically tailored meals for this groundbreaking two-year study that integrates nutrition and social needs in order to reduce diabetes in the Native American community. Unfortunately, Native Americans have some of the highest di diabetes rates, and so this is definitely a cause for action for our community members to have available resources for them. This unique food is this medicine program continues to invite members of the Native American community to participate. Either call 213-764-4550 for the Native American Diabetes Project or email the project at nativedm at usc.edu. Are you nervous? A little, maybe. But I won't be when we get on the field. That's award-winning actress Ruby D with baseball player Jackie Robinson, who broke Major League's infamous color barrier when he played for the Brooklyn Dodgers, April 1947. Well, in this movie, he plays himself in the 1950 movie, The Jackie Robinson Story. You can see this historic film at the Academy of Museum Motion Pictures this afternoon at 2 p.m. Ticket information is on the academymuseum.org website. Oh yeah, that's the boss, Bruce Springsteen. Explore the evolution of his award-winning career at the new Grammy Museum exhibition, Bruce Springsteen Live. Even if you know, if you've read all the books, you've gone to all the shows, seeing a lot of this stuff firsthand is the first time you're gonna be able to get this close to it. The GrammyMuseum.org website has all of the visitor information. That's Southern California ceramic artist Joan Takayama Ogawa. Her extraordinary work is on display at the Craft in America Center Los Angeles, where you will find her new exhibition, Ceramic Beacon. Beauty was very important at the beginning, just pure beauty, pure form. And, and I think I've always sought pure beauty, pure form, and now I layer it on with a common, a dark humor. Schedule your visit to explore her incredible ceramics at the craftinamerica.org website. So, let's make this a sculptural ceramic Sunday. Gail Anderson, KTLA 5 News. All right. The